What's up, you guys? This is Minister Williams. I am. This post is a pre-post for this week on our How to Walk in Peace series. So last week we did chapter one, three three videos on chapter one. This week we're gonna do chapter two. We're gonna begin and end chapter two this week, just like we began and ended chapter one last week. So chapter two, title: You Can Say No to strife and we're going to talk about what strife is and how important it is that we didn't strife you know as soon as it begins and how um strife will hold us back from a lot of things that the father wants um for us so it's very important even in our churches and our ministries and our everyday lives in you know relationships with those close to us we have to learn to be at peace with all men we don't have to agree with everything that you know everyone says in order to get along with them you know most people don't understand that but God requires that that is what we do so um the first video uh, we're gonna go into chapter two intro into it again chapter two you can say no to strife and the introduction to the lesson is gonna take us in and we're gonna talk about this the intro is gonna come directly from Joyce herself so I got that Word for word from her, I didn't want to take the introduction away because this, what she's saying is very, very important. And the second video, um, chapter two, you can say no to strife. The subtopic topic is adapt and adjust. And I love that because the Apostle Paul teaches us that as believers, we should be able to adapt and adjust and change with with the the things that are changing adapt to change to the things that are around us so it's very important that as believers we know how to adapt and adjust and the last video which is going to be ending chapter two the subtopic is let love be your god and that is very very powerful so stay on this how to walk in peace series with me again we're going into chapter two you can say no to strife and we're going to find out what strife is we're going to define it so we can see where we are in this thing because we all are guilty of strife at one point or another and we need to know the importance of how the father feels about strife and how big of a hindrance it can be to us if we do not deal with strife head on in Jesus name. So this is Mr. Williams, y'all. This is a pre-post into chapter two on our, on our How to Walk in Peace series. Stick and stay on this How to Walk in Peace series and it's going to get greater later. I'm telling you what I know in Jesus name. So y'all get into these lessons and I post them so you can listen um, to them or watch them on your own time. Don't fit God into your schedule. He is your schedule. So make sure that you do what you're supposed to do. Make sure you get your priorities in line and get this information in because it's going to bless you and bless you greatly. In Jesus name.